you're sitting down on that right hand and you really want it to crack, again, everything comes from the hips, ball of the back foot, about 60% of your weight's on your right, on your lead foot, and then you, all you're doing from here, so if we're here and you see you want to set that right hand up, you see the shots there, you just turn and boom, just throw it, boom. Okay, so it could be just a one, two, jab, Face the jab, boom, throw the right hand. You want to finish with the hook. Again, it's easy because once you've, you're here, all right, you, you pop in that jab, pop in that jab, pop the jab, right hand, you're already there. Weight's on the front leg here, and then all you're doing is just bringing the weight back as you're bringing the right hand back, turning the shoulder, boom, and then the hook's coming right, right behind it. All right, so here, and then boom, everything twists from the hips. Boom, boom, bang. All right, and that's where your hook's coming, here. Uh, do it the right way from the beginning. That first 25 reps is gonna soft wire it, okay? So you don't really have to think a whole lot about it, okay? Stepping with it, stepping with it, stepping with it. All right, step, right hand, okay? Step, right hand, all right? Practice it slow and deliberate, okay, to soft wire it, and then you can start speeding it up. Jab low, okay, right hand, the cup, pour in the cup, pour in the cup, right hand, pour in the cup, pour in the cup, again, turn in the hip, okay, turn in the hip, if it's just a straight right hand like a jab, like I was telling you, like you see Pauli Malignaggi use, all right, for instance, then again, it's just, just like that, and you want to throw your punches eye level, you know, when you practice, when you're shadow boxing, you want to just throw your punches at eye level. I'm uh, just giving you my take on some things and hopefully it helps you out. All right? It's your man, Coach Rick. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. Peace.